Hello everyone, I'm Jay from TechForce and one of the questions I get asked uh, more often is how do I get into cybersecurity? How do I get a job in cybersecurity? Right? This is my personal opinion. Uh, getting into cybersecurity is a bit tricky, right? Uh, getting into IT is relatively easier than getting into cybersecurity. And then moving from IT into cybersecurity is much easier than trying to get a job as a cybersecurity engineer right so at least most of the people i know that are working in cybersecurity or have some sort of they come from it background either it engineer system engineer it auditor you know it manager all sorts of different titles different backgrounds right or some some for for other people they have done a cybersecurity degree at university and then moved into a cybersecurity role as an apprenticeship or graduate role and then you know build it from there right so if you're getting the gist it's relatively trickier or relatively um you know more harder getting into getting started in cybersecurity than getting a job in it right so that's one aspect but the rest right why why do you want to get into cybersecurity right as uh, Simon Sinek says, start with why. What's your what's your why? Why do you want to get into cybersecurity? Is it for money? Is it your passion? You know, do you really like solving problems, solving cha you know a, a challenging career, right? So that if it's for money, I would say stop. <laughs> um, at some point, you will get bored or uh, complacent. You will get so you know get into cyber for the right reasons, um, and then. What do you want to do in cybersecurity? One of the misconceptions people have is, you know, as soon as you say, I work in cybersecurity, um, they think you are hacking people, you are a hacker, you are working with this, you know, six monitors with green screens and coding flying over all, um, you know, <laughs> ones and zeros flying over, uh, all over the place, right? Um, but it's not. And as a cybersecurity analyst, it, it does happen, but it's very, very um, occasionally happens. Um, but as a cybersecurity engineer, you're 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 plowing through the logs. You're working with spreadsheets. You are uh, doing all sorts of analysis, um, right? It's not as they show you on in movies. Um, you're looking at firewall logs. You're making firewall rules. You're um, you know inspecting something. You know, you're doing a number of things, or you're training people. Um, <laughs> um, so you're looking for phishing emails and uh, all sorts, right? But what I'm trying to say here is, again, cybersecurity is not about hacking. Right? There are a number of different paths in cybersecurity you can take. And one of them is the ethical hacker. But the rest, so you have security analyst, you have auditor, you have trainer, you have risk advisor, number of different roles, and not all of them needs um, you know, hacking skills or strong technical skills. Right, um, you have you know digital forensics as well, um, which is another one. So um, the way I I would look at it is, what's your what's your what are your skills, right? And do you have transferable skills you can bring in from your existing career into cybersecurity? Maybe that's one way to look at it and move into a role, look for an opportunity, and you know um, um, get get a start from there right um, enthusiasm you have to be enthusiastic in cybersecurity the the industry changes so quick um, you have to you have to be open minded you have to be enthusiastic about learning new things and uh, another thing is you know when you want to get into cybersecurity follow some people who will in, who inspire you who are uh, you know who are well known in the industry and Follow them on Twitter, follow them on LinkedIn, and see what they are saying. You know, uh, maybe engage with them, right? Maybe one day they may have a role, and you, you may be able to apply. You may be able to reach out to them directly, right? So that's a, another good way uh, to get a start as well. And um, certification, this is a bit, um, I wouldn't say controversial, but some people are up for it, some people are against it, or some people are neutral. But I am um, for the certifications. Certifications prove you that you are dedicating your time, you are 
um, you have put a goal for yourself and you are achieving this certification, which means most of the times you, you have the knowledge to show you have the knowledge. Um, you have a certification that means you have the knowledge, right? And also certifications are um, goes well with your CV and it gets you to the interview. And from the interview to the job, that's your experience that takes you to the job, right? But here we are um, talking about getting started in cybersecurity. So uh, basic certifications like, you know, CompuTIA, Security Plus, or IC Square, SSC, uh, SSCP, or GIAC Cyber Essentials, uh, sorry, GIAC Cyber, um, uh, is it yeah security essentials I think it is called yeah some something like that um, so one of those certifications will help but if you're going for a technical role in cybersecurity um, this is the basic rule of thumb you need to have a good understanding of how the computers work how the network works how they talk to each other how the internet works how they you know cloud works right you need to have really good understanding if you're going for a, a technical role or most of the time other roles as well you need to have some sort of knowledge right so i hope uh, that gives you a, a a a good understanding of how you can get into cyber security uh, as i said in the, at the beginning it is relatively easier to get into it than cyber security so you may want to take that route right getting into it as a it a, you know help desk engineer it service desk engineer it system admin you know something like that and then once you uh, got into the role you get an understanding of how the systems and network and everything works and then you can uh, uh, in your spare time you can start studying for cyber security or your, you can start understanding what cyber security is and how uh, it goes with your job and um, also you may have an opportunity you may have an opening in your own company for security analyst or uh, of some sort right so you can take either go from IT to cybersecurity or go from university degree to cybersecurity or go directly to into cybersecurity, but that might take um, uh, longer, right? Thank you very much. If you have any questions, leave a comment below or reach out to me. I'm Jay from TechForce, right? You have a great day.